Hello, this is me Helmut Flash and um, I'm going to answer a question which I get from doctors all the time and that is how do I get more patients referral? I'm going to answer this question but before I answer the question I'm going to tell you this. Patients referrals almost never, actually never, will be enough for you to have a big thriving business. So forget about what you learned in school that if you do good work patients will refer. Obviously you already witness that that doesn't happen because that's why I get the question all the time. How do I increase patients referral? I do so good work, I do this, I do this, I do this, people don't come. No more patients loyalty. Well call it a bad thing, call it a not so good thing, it doesn't really matter. The fact is it's not happening. Uh, the world is too busy for people to talk about the doctor all the time. They go to 10, maybe 15 doctors, you know, from a podiatrist to an eye doctor, to a cardiologist, to a family doctor, to a dentist, to a chiropractor, all kinds of doctors they go to. If they would only talk to their friends about, pa about which doctor they like, they would be shunned by every patient right away. So anyway, um, how do I get more patients uh, referrals? First of all, as I said, it is almost impossible if not totally impossible to get enough patients from patients referrals so forget about it. However, what you need to do is you need to learn how to ask patients for referrals without ever asking um, uh, them. I'm sure you have heard um, the saying if you ask you get. So first of all almost every consultant tells you ask patients referral, ask, ask, ask. Most patients, uh, most doctors, most staff are reluctant to it. They go, how often can I ask? Shouldn't they refer me automatically? Well, they should, but they don't do it. Um, the asking is a lot better than not asking, of course. But here's one, one better thing. You know, if when you ask, you shall get. It's a statement, it's a true statement. However, there's a better one. Give and you shall get absolutely better. So what you need to do is you need to give your patients an opportunity to give something to another patient, not to themselves for doing it, but something to another patient, a friend of them, in order to refer you business. So for instance, um, to give you an example, if you see um, a, a car shop and they have, uh, I don't know, um, a special, special Goodyear tires on sale and you know a friend who needs right now tires, you will tell him to go there because there's a good sale. Why? Because you care for Goodyear tire? I doubt it. You care for your friend. So that's what you need to instill. So in the industry those things are called a lost leader. Create a wonderful lost leader, a gift. You a patient is giving to his friends and co-workers whom he sees much more often than you, whom he cares much more than he cares about you and he wants to help them. Keep in mind 80% of all patients out there do not regularly see for instance a dentist. Okay, um, They just don't or a podiatrist and whether the percentage is 80 or 50 whatever you agree it doesn't really matter. Lots of people don't have a regular doctor otherwise there would be doctor loyalty wouldn't there? There isn't. This is what you need to show the patients. Now, there is more on this topic, there's quite a bit more on this topic and I will let you know with about a dozen of videos on unadvertise.com free slash free unadvertise.com slash free. Go there, find a dozen of videos uh, on this and other rather important subjects and you are going to be on your way making it in this economy. See you on the other side.